What up, what up, guys? It's your boy Diesel Boost here. And today we're going to do something that I hoped that I didn't have to do so soon. But uh, as some of you may know, I use a, trans I use a transmission from a 250 diesel. Uh, 85 something horsepower diesel car, NA diesel. On the in the silver 944, and it just couldn't keep up with the power. So here the other day I was trying to work and sweat pang sharaitu, and uh, the third gear just uh, didn't want to do it anymore. So now we're gonna go out, fire it up, and. Uh, <laughs> that you hear the sound that the transmission makes because it's uh, it is clearly not happy but it's uh, cold outside dark outside so we'll make do with what, it, what we get so hopefully it has power <laughs> so I can get it to start Some electric keys here, so... Now we're in the car. It's... It has been cold outside, so... <laughs> it's icy in all the windows. And I can't really see a damn thing. Let's hope it uh, starts. As you can hear, there's something more than just a diesel noise. It doesn't really like to move now. Transmission, transmission sticks and all that good stuff, so... And I can't see a damn thing out the window. So, I'll just drive it in, so I don't bump into any cars or anything. Now the car is in, and uh, as you heard, it's it doesn't like it. The third gear is gone, and uh, the tooths from uh, the third gear are laying down in the oil and splashed up with the gears and getting inside of uh, other gears. So it's not good to drive with, but I still have. Uh, Four gears and the racing gear, so that's not too bad. So I'm gonna get it up on the lift and I'm gonna try something new today. I'm gonna stick a GoPro in my forehead and see if I can actually film something of the things I do to my car, not just show you that here's what I've done. So let's hope that makes a better video. So as you can see, I have uh, mounted the GoPro, just trying to get some light on it, because uh, underneath the car here, it's very dark. Or at least the GoPro thinks it, think it is. This camera actually can do it, I think. But this only is a little bit big to put on my head, even though I'm fairly thick in the head. <laughs> That's a Norwegian joke. Maybe it doesn't work in English, but I don't care. So, here's the new one, guys. It's from a 124-260E, 2.6 liter straight six with a petrol injection. And it's from an ambulance. So, I cross my fingers that it fits and it has longer gear ratio. Because that is one thing both of my car is cars are missing, both the 945 and the 44. They uh, have so short ratios that uh, it's almost unpleasant to drive on the highway. So, cross my fingers that it is a little bit longer ratio. And uh, 
Yeah, I'm gonna try to fix some lights so you can see what's happening. And or else I have to get my girlfriend to film me with this camera because I have lights set up and all of that. So cross your fingers that I can get some light on it. So stay tuned. We're gonna test if the sound on the GoPro picks up this. For this job we need a 15 mm socket, 17, a 14 and a 12, as far as I know. So I'm gonna pick up the tools I need and a 17 mil wrench or what you might call the bobber. And of course we're gonna use power tools because I'm too lazy to screw it by hand. And of course, it's uh, very useful to have a transmission hoist when you're doing stuff like this, because then I don't have to do it by hand. Now I'm swallowed Now I'm the fool while you're breaking rules Dangerous path that I follow oh, 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 oh. Go on, just do what you do
transmission is out and uh, took about 20-25 minutes so not a bad thing and uh, here it is and as you can hear there is uh, something inside of that transmission that is not happy so luckily it uh, had the right input shaft so the new ambulance transmission will just uh, slip right in and bolt on so yay me <laughs> so we're gonna swap over the linkages to the gear lever over on the new transmission and then we're gonna put it in and I guess just try it Now the transmission is back in the car, as you can uh, see here, trans, trans is back in the car, full with new fluids, and everything is just fine. So now we're going to test drive it and hopefully take it back home, because I missed the car. I really do. So, I hope you liked this video. And if you did, press the like button, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one.